Hello everyone. Welcome back to our YouTube channel MJ Manjari. Today we have brought you another free online training program conducted by CIT NCERT. And today's training is Innovate and Lead School Transformation Strategy and Online Training Series for School Leader. This training was live on YouTube from 16th September to 29th September. It was 8 day training program and you are going to get 8 hours of certificate. First, who all can participate in this training program? So, school principals, headmaster, teacher, teacher educator, curriculum planner, administrator and general public. All this can participate in this training program. Now, let's see how you can participate. So, for participation, different steps are there. Your first step is registration. So you need to register using this Google form. I have already given the link of this website. You just click on this Google form, fill this Google form and your registration is done. And if you need the certificate, then you need to join this course on Diksha platform. That I will also show you as here written. If you are interested in earning a certificate, you need to join the course on Diksha portal, which will be open after 30 February. 30 September means this training was conducted on YouTube from 16th to 29th September and on Diksha it will be available only after 30 September. After joining the course you need to go through all the videos then take the final assessment and if your score is 70% and above you will receive certificate within 15 to 20 days. Now let's see how you can participate in this training program. So first thing you need to do, you need to go on Google and type Diksha platform. Then the first one which is says Diksha.gov.in. Just click on it. For login, you just need to click on this triple dot and then you will get here login option. So just click on login. Now if you know the password and all, then you just enter your email ID, password and click on login if you don't know the password then you can log in through your google account as well and i am going to log in through my google account so you just need to click in sign in with google then you need to choose your gmail i will select my gmail from here they are going to ask you a few permissions so just click on continue button here second method you should have this to app in your mobile diksha and Diksha course. So first you need to go on Diksha app. So now let's open Diksha app. Now you need to log in in Diksha app. If you know the password and email ID, you just need to enter email ID and password and login. Otherwise you can sign in through Google also. Now as you can see on the top, your name is visible. That means you have logged in in Diksha app. Now you need to click on course here. So your second app Diksha course will automatically get logged in and you can open access that app so now let's click on courses here so now as you can see your diksha course app is open and here also your name is visible means you have logged in now you next you need to go on explore courses where you will get all the courses available by diksha so let's click on explore courses now here list of all the course is available to you you either you can select innovate and lead or you can just type on the search option and click on search button as you can see if i scroll down many courses are coming and here i got this innovate and lead school transformation strategy duration is eight hour means if you complete this course you are going to get certificate of eight hours so now let's click here so this is the course outline where you need to select your batch then confirm and enroll so now let's select my batch and confirm and enroll so now you have successfully enrolled for this course as you can see so now this course is available here and next you need to go on lessons so if you go on lessons here you will see all the modules like module 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and last module is assessment first you need to go through all this module like module 1 
if you click here you will get pdf and then you will get video you need to watch all this for all the module after that only go on assessment and appear for assessment in assessment if your score is 70 percent or above then only you will get the certificate that's all for today's video if this video is helpful for you don't forget to like and subscribe the channel and share it with your friends we'll meet in another video with some more interesting information for you till then goodbye keep learning